Review is of IBC Root Beer. Since 1999, 1919, sorry, uh, it uses cane sugar. It's naturally and artificially flavored. If you'd like to see the nutrition and ingredients, I'm going to see if I can get that glare. There we go. I don't know if you can see that well enough, but there's no glare at least. I'll try it this way. There we go. That's a bit better. Okay. So, um, I've had IBC before. I don't have a problem with it. It's not my favorite, but, you know, it's, it's good enough. Um, I think that probably Boylan is one of the best ones I've had. There are some other brands I've had in the past that I really like that aren't around anymore. All right, so this is supposed to be a twist-off. Um, I know this because my son had one last night, and as you can see, it's got the threads. Um, wasn't able to twist it off. I'm going to try. There we go. Got it off. All right. So, right away I can smell the, the sweet root beer fl uh, flavor you expect. Hmm. I'm curious. Do they use sarsaparilla or, or does it not say? Um, I don't know. It does have corn uh, starch. Why? I don't know what they have more corn starch in there for. I suppose it's a thickener. Um, but and there's also kilaya, kiaya, q u i l l a i a extract, which I think is also some kind of a flavor enhancer or something like that. I'm not really sure. Uh, so let's go ahead and give this a shot. Sorry, I had to let the cat in. As with all root beers, it's got lots of carbonation. It's not too sweet, which is good. Um, I kind of wish the flavor was a bit more potent. But it's good. There's nothing wrong with it. I don't dislike it. I'd have to sit down with a whole bunch of different root beers to find the one that I preferred. Um, but this is fine. So thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.